Now we will perform NCRT questions. Question one: Which of the following cannot be charged easily by friction? These are the options before us: a plastic scale, a copper rod, an inflated balloon, a wooden cloth. Answer is a copper rod. Explanation for this reason is. Only non-conducting material can be easily charged by friction. Copper is a highly conducting material, so copper cannot be charged easily by friction. Question number second: When a glass rod is rubbed with a piece of silk cloth, the rod. There are four options. We have choose the correct. The correct option is. The glass rod becomes positively charged while the cloth has a negative charge. It is a convention to say that when a glass rod is rubbed with silk, the charge acquired by the glass rod is positive. The other kind of charge acquired by the silk cloth is said to be negative. Now we are to find true and false against the following statements. Like charges attract each other. Answer: False. Like charges repel each other. Suppose these are the positive charges. These are the two negative charges. In both these cases, these charges will repel each other. However, if there is one positive charge body and the other is negative charge body then there will be attraction between the two bodies next a charged glass rod attract a charged plastic etc true a charged glass rod has positive charge on its surface while a charged plastic etc has negative charge on its surface since opposite charges attract each other so the charged glass rod attracts charged plastic etc c lightning conductor cannot protect a building from lightning answer is false the main purpose of lightning conductor is to protect the building from lightning during lightning the lightning conductor transfers the lightning energy directly to the earth and hence protects the building from lightning suppose this is the building here we have installed lightning conductor when there is lightning it strikes the there are more chances that it will strike the lightning conductor and from that place there is a wire attached to the lightning rod which is ultimately goes to a plate which is below the surface of the earth and so the lightning charge passes from the lightning rod to the earth and the building remains safe next earthquakes can be predicted in advance false there is no instrument to predict earthquake in advance next sometimes a cracking sound is heard while taking off sweater when during winters explain when a sweater is taken off the woolen sweater gets charged because of friction between the sweater and the body and sometimes a cracking sound is heard during the given process next question 5 fifth explain why a charged body loses its charge if we touch it with our hand a charged object loses its charge if we touch it by hand because the charge from the charged body flows to the earth through our body suppose this is a charged body we touch it by hand from that the charge flows to our hand and then ultimately is passes from our body to the earth so whole of the charge which a charged body has will pass on to the earth and it will become chargeless next name the scale 
on which destructive energy of an earthquake is measured an earthquake measures three on this scale would it be recorded by a seismograph seismograph is it likely to cause much damage answer the destructive energy of the earthquake can be measured on richter scale yes an earthquake measuring three on the richter scale would be recorded by the seismograph this earthquake of magnitude three is not likely to cause much damage generally earthquake of magnitude higher than five is considered destructive in nature here we have shown that if there is the ranges of the magnitudes of the earthquake and the classification of those for example if an earthquake is between 5 to 5.9 it is considered as moderate if it is between 7 and 7.9 it is considered as major and above 8 all the earthquakes are considered as great earthquakes and the consequences of that earthquakes are likely to cause much damage to the animal human life as well as property damage next seventh question suggests three measures to protect ourselves from lightning first is don't bath under running water because running water may cause an electric shock next during lightning open space is very unsafe if a person is in open space at the time of lightning he must rush to a house or building which is covered at the time of lightning stay inside the room if you are traveling in a car or in a bus stay inside the car or bus with with windows and doors shut avoid using umbrella at the time of lightning because lightning may strike the top and metal of the road of umbrella and then harm us because suppose this is the umbrella and you have got hold of it it this is made of metal this is metal if there is lightning then it will strike the metal road and ultimately it may pass on you because you have hold it and it will ultimately cause harm to you next is do not touch any metal port next eighth question explain why a charged balloon is repelled by another charged balloon whereas an uncharged balloon is attracted by another charged balloon answer is a charged balloon has the same charge as another charged balloon so there is repulsion between these two charged balloons because like charges repel each other on the other hand when a charged body is brought near an uncharged body the uncharged body acquires a charge opposite to that of charged body by induction so an uncharged balloon is attracted by a charged balloon question ninth describe with the help of a diagram an instrument which is can be used to detect a charged body answer is an electroscope can be used to detect whether a body is charged or not here we have given the photograph of an aluminium leaf electroscope it consists of a metal disc at the top then there comes metal rod and at this point there are two aluminium strips when the metal disc is touched by a charged body these aluminium strips move away from each other because the aluminium strips receive the same charge from the metal disc through the metal rod if there is a charged body brought near it the charge from that rod will pass through the metal rod to the aluminium strips and they will receive the same charge and they will drift away from each other if the body is not charged the leaves of the file would remain as they were before then there will be 
no problem the aluminum strips will remain as they were earlier list three states in india where earthquakes are more likely to occur three states in india where earthquakes can occur are gujarat himachal pradesh arunachal pradesh and assam in fact the whole of north east indian states fall in earthquake zone 5 north indian states are arunachal pradesh assam mizoram meghalaya tripura in some of the textbooks it is written that Jammu and Kashmir also falls in the three states where earthquakes are likely to strike. It is correct that Jammu and Kashmir is also a, an area where earthquake is more likely to occur. But the Jammu and Kashmir is no longer a state. It has become a union territory about two, three years ago. So we should not mention Jammu and Kashmir in the list of the states. where the there are chances more chances of earthquake because it has now been designated as union territory which falls under the central government next question 11 suppose you are outside your home and an earthquake occurs what precautions would you take to protect yourself if you are outdoors and an earthquake strikes we would we should take some precautions to protect ourselves keep away from high rise buildings trees sign board overhead power lines so that they do not fall on us if we are moving in a car stop safely as soon as possible and set set the parking brake and remain inside the car till the tremors of the earthquake stop next 11 uh, question number 12 the weather department has predicted that a thunderstorm is likely to occur on a certain day suppose you are to go outside on that day would you carry umbrella no i would not carry an umbrella on that day because normally a thunderstorm is accompanied by lightning the lightning may strike the top and metal rod of umbrella and the lightning may ultimately harm me now we will perform some multiple choice questions earthquake of which magnitude of the falling cause the maximum damage as we know that richter scale or any other magnitude scale is a 10 point 10 scale 10 base scale as we move further the destructive power of this earthquake increases by 31.6 times so when we move from 1 to 2 the destruction power increases by 31.6 times if we move from 2 to 3 destruction again increases by 31.6 times that is at point three the destruction will be 100 times more than that caused on magnitude of scale a uh, earthquake of magnitude 1 so as we move forward the magnitude increases as well as destruction increases so here the destruction will be more in the case of d seven the shaking and trembling of the earth is called when the earth trembles or shakes it is called earthquake p tsunami tsunami is the earthquake when it occurs in sea it is called tsunami so our answer is earthquake next major earthquakes are less likely to occur in as already told that north east indian states all fall in the zone 5 category some of the place of rajasthan falls in category 2 3 and 4 in the seismic zones 
zone two, three, and four of which are likely to bear the chances of earthquakes are there. It falls in category five, zone five. So Odisha falls in the category of zone two. So major earthquakes are less likely to occur in Odisha. The like charges, as already told, suppose these are like charges, they repel each other. If there are opposite charges, then there is attraction between the two charges. So like charges repel each other. Now come question fifth. The outermost layer of the earth is called. Here we have been given four options. Our answer is crust C. As already told that our earth has four layers. First comes crust, then comes mantle, then comes outer core and then comes the inner core. It can be the layers of the, the earth can be compared with an apple. Suppose this is an apple. As we know that there is the inner core. This is the core. This is the skin. This is the skin. Skin is known as skin of the apple can be compared with the crust of the earth. This is the area of the apple which we eat. It can be compared with mental. This is the core area which we remove from the apple. So this is the inner as well as the outer core of the earth. Inner as well as outer. Inner is inside. This is the outside of the area. This is outer core. So this is outer most part of the earth is called crust. Next question six. Where is lightning conductor located? On the top of the building, middle of the building, anywhere can be installed. Suppose this is the building. Lightning conductor is located on the top of the building. From here a wire is attached. It goes to the earth where a plate is hidden inside in the earth and the lightning passes from the lightning conductor to the earth and the building is safe. Our answer is A. On the top of the building. Next. The process of electric discharge can occur between two or more clouds, clouds and the earth within a single thunder cloud unit. As already told that lightning can take place between within a single cloud, between two different clouds or between the cloud and the earth. This is the cloud. This is also a cloud. Lightning can occur between two clouds within the same cloud or between the cloud and the earth. So our answer is R, A, B and C. Next. The epicenter of an earth is located. Where it is located? On the surface of the earth. Suppose this is the earth. This will be the epicenter. This will be the focus of the earthquake. Suppose this is the focus. And the area which lies just above that, this is the surface of the earth and this is the epicenter. It is located on the surface of the earth. From here, the seismic waves move. Separate. From the focus of the earthquake. Next. A device which can be used to test whether an object is carrying a charge or not is called electroscope. We should also understand for what purpose is periscope. You may have seen submarines. It is used. A periscope it is used in submarines to see on the 
सरफेस ऑफ दी वाटर माइक्रोस्कोप इज यूज टू सी दी माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिजम टेलीस्कोप इज यूज टू हेमली बॉडीज टू सी ऑब्जेक्ट इन द स्काई और इन दी मून और दी अदर थिंग्स एन अर्थक्वेक अंडर दी ओशन कैन काज टू नामी Lightning occurs in the sky. Thunderstorm also in the sky. High tide is caused by caused by moon. Next eleventh. During a thunderstorm, the charges accumulate near the upper edges of the clouds. Are suppose this is a cloud. Here will be upper end. There will be the positive charge and the lower end. There will be the negative charges. So charges accumulate that accumulate near the upper edges are. positively charged next sparks can be seen on an electric pole when wires become loose when there is loose of electric wires then there we see sparking next Thirteenth movement of tectonic plates leads to earthquake. Plates are cast, may be cast by rains, or if a dam overflows, or dam is washed away, then there may be flood, or lightning is cast when there is. electric discharge from the clouds tsunami occurs in the sea question 14 as per convention what is the charge on a glass rod when it is rubbed with a silk cloth as per convention when the charge on a glass rod is positive when it is rubbed with silk cloth next question 15 An earthquake of magnitude eight or nine on Richter scale is here. We have been given four options: strong, very weak, mild, and not felt. For the purpose of understanding, we have given here you the table of the magnitude of earthquakes and what it will be the likely consequences. An earthquake of six and above that is strong. Seven and between seven and nine. It is major eight and above. It is considered as great. But here we will see that strong earthquake is from six and between six point nine. But here we have no option of great. So we will regard maximum where what we have been given. So our answer will be strong. Next, which of the following is not a safe place? During lightning, if we are in an open area, then it is quite possible that we may be struck by the lightning. It is wrong. It is not a safe place. If we are on a elevated elevated ridge, elevated ridge means it may be a mountain or a hill range, which may be on a height. So this is also wrong. But if we are inside a house, we may be safe. so which of the following is not a safe place both b and c open area as well as elevated ridge is not a safe place during lightning next if two charged objects are brought close to each other then what will be the likely consequences will they attract each other repel each other what will be the reaction or there will be no effect here we have not been given whether the charged objects are of the same charge or the two charged objects are having different charges we have not been given any option they may repel each other or they may attract each other anything can happen so our answer will be they may attract each other or depending on 
or repel depending on the charges they carry answer will be c next tsunami means earthquakes under the sea next during lightning actually dash takes place electric discharge takes place you will have to write full in the exam and note a or b or c only next during thunderstorm it is safer to carry an open umbrella if you carry an open umbrella the lightning may accompany thunderstorm and it may cause harm to you so it is safer no take shelter in the tall trees if there is a very tall tree and if it is a short tree this is a short tree this is a large uh, shorter tree if there is a tall tree there are more chances that lightning may hit it for more striking it earlier the chances of striking tall trees are more so it may if it strikes the lightning to the tall tree it may burn so it is not option correct if we are in an open field we are standing then the lightning may also occur and strike us and we may burn severely so this is also not correct so from the given options it is correct that it is safer to take shelter under short trees this is the safe option answer is short trees which of the following occurs during lightning acid rain occurs no acid rain occurs at the time of rain may occur because of the accumulation of acid in the air because of air pollution greenhouse effect occurs due to greenhouse gases accumulate in the atmosphere earthing is a process by which dis electric discharge takes place before from a charged body to the earth most of the nitrogen fixation is session is done by plants as you have read in the books some of the nitrogen fixation only a few percentage of the total nitrogen fixation is done by lightning so our answer is lightning lightning always follows rain no every time there is rain there is no but lightning always follows thunder there is no easy or straight path for the lightning lightning may occur any time anyways direct or in an, any manner they may strike thanks for watching if you like our course please bear some time to give a star rating to our posts